My name is Mark Engelhard. I am a senior research scientist, chemist, and my specialty is X-ray photoelectron spectroscopy. This instrument is an X-ray photoelectron spectrometer, and we bombard a sample with soft X-rays to derive the chemical composition and bonding environment of the elements in the sample. What's unique about this instrument, we've customized this commercial XPS instrument to allow for samples to be treated and processed in anoxic environments and transferred directly into the spectrometer for characterization. Sample holders have been modified and customized for unique types of samples. We also have the ability to process the samples in aqueous environments, in gas environments. We can treat samples to a variety of different gas conditions and environmental conditions and study these in a near in situ analysis mode. XPS as a technique is valuable for our BER users. Many want to understand soil chemistry, soil composition. X-ray photoelectron spectroscopy is a very valuable technique that studies the very near surface of the material. It studies the first, say, 10 nanometers of a, of a sample. We're, we're providing chemical and bonding information that's really important to researchers that want to understand things such as carbon, nitrogen, phosphorus, sulfur speciation. So you're getting this information using a microprobe technique. So spatial information, chemical information, and quantification are the strengths of this technique. We have users that are looking at atmospheric interactions with soil and minerals in soil. And we've looked at nitrogen, simulated nitrogen reactions in these soils, looking at the nitrogen bonding environment. XPS is a complement to other materials characterization techniques. Um, XPS provides the surface chemical state of a sample. Many other techniques are more bulk analysis. It's important to combine both bulk and surface information in order to understand what's going on with your material.